taught me, you know, how to be grateful, how to love my, you know, my, my family and cherish them, how to use my time wisely, how to multitask, how to lead people. I'm actually really nervous, guys. <laughs> He's looking at me like, what's up? You got a game? Gino. Jump. <laughs> uh, sit. Gino, sit. Paul. Let go. Hold on, sit, sit, Gino, sit. No, don't eat, don't eat, eat. Yo! Yeah, 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 guys, what is up now with Beast Checking in? Hopefully you guys are having a great day. It is a beautiful Saturday morning, so I'm gonna take you guys along, get you guys out of the floor, and begin our day, so let's do this. So we got some stuff. We went with the little sunrise monster, and then we got the almond uh, protein bar here. So in Japan, they do this little thing. Um, um, whenever you're talking to them, the Japanese girls or guys, well, no, no, not the guys usually, but the girls do. Hi. Yeah, I got the And it's so funny. I'm like, oh, like it's cute and it's funny. I'm like, and I start to do it as well. I'm just like, I start talking like that to the Japanese locals. I'm like, hi. And I'm like, oh my yeah. god, they're like, yo. Are the you... more you're here, you more you adapt to their culture, you... and then you start mm -hmm. doing it yourself. Yeah, so. dude, definitely. And it's it's crazy because then you start to like, I don't know, you start to feel Japanese. But little bit, little bit. then you realize, like, you you, you hear a full blown conversation from a Japanese local, and you're, you're like, just like, hi. yeah, like, hi, no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> but but for me, usually I play it off, so I'm just like, because mm, 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 mm. that's what they do, mm, 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 mm. Mm. hi, hi, that's true. And then at the end of it, they're like, like, do you understand? I'm like, hi. <laughs> and really, you're like, no. <laughs> yeah, like in, in reality, I'm like, Shit. he doesn't know. I'm like sweating. Hi. Hey! Gino, Gino. Chill, man. You good? Gino! Gino! <laughs> Guys, so um, our boy here is gonna show me what's up with this dog. He's like, yo, my dog can do some crazy ass tricks. So I'm like, alright, let's see. Let's see what this dog is made of because you guys have seen my dog and what he can do. Let me rise! Yeah! That's what I'm. No, no, don't eat yet. Absolutely nothing. So we're gonna see what this dog can do. It's like I told you before, man. You gotta train your dog like you train a marine. Hey. Sit. Paul. Down. Roll over. <gasps> the boy. Stay. 360. Sit. Dude. Uh-uh. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Eat. <laughs> so dope. Did you just give him one treat? I gave him, I gave him a couple. I gave him a couple. Uh, I was gonna feel bad. No, no I, gave I, gave a a I gave him a couple. I gave him a couple. Dare you? I know, dude. Dude. Mm. What's another good command? Gino. 360. 360. Fly, Gino. Fly. <laughs> Fly. Things <laughs> are getting good, man. I'm getting good. Day two. Alrighty guys, so um, it is actually the uh, later on that day. So now we're gonna go to the gym. We're gonna get a freaking swole on. So you already know what time it is. You already know, comment down below. Wait, oh, time. Yeah, it's about that time, guys. Like I said, I just, I, I don't know, man. Um, I just want you guys to realize, yo, you got one life, you're alive. Hey, make it happen, dude. At the end of the day, you know, you're the one that's gonna be laying on that deathbed, you know, re regretting all those missed opportunities you could have taken. But, you know, I'm not gonna get all, in, uh, you know, emotional and sentimental and, and motivational right now because right now it's about that time. So we're gonna go grind real quick. Someone texted me. I'm trying to, trying to freaking vlog, bro. Come on, man. But um, aside from that, guys, we're running low on the fuego, which is not no bueno. Uh, today, we're actually going to be hitting back and biceps, I believe. So I'm going to take you guys along the workout, kind of explain it, maybe talk over it. And uh, yeah, so a little quick thing, guys, is that my workouts, dude, I am trying to vlog, bro. Ski, what, what, who's... Okay, I'll, I'll check it right now. But um, anyways, so yeah, this, this year, man, I'm taking my training to the next level. Like my whole body is sore right now. 
Like it is crazy how sore it is. Um, I definitely been, I haven't been eating bad since, you know, January 1st. Uh, yesterday I did have like a little extra bit of carbs. You know, I had a little Baskin Robbins maybe and uh, some extra sushi, but that's about it. I'm not gonna go full blown. And that's probably like the biggest mistake guys is, you know, when you're gonna have a cheat meal or a planned refeed, yo, don't go overboard, okay? That's probably what's gonna, you know, I'm gonna freaking destroy that phone over there. Who? Anyways, yeah. That being said, hey man, control yourself, all right? Because at the end of the day, the next day you wake up and you like you you ate all that food the the night prior, hey man, you're not gonna feel as good, you know. So rather than doing that, just chug down a bunch of water. That's probably like my biggest tip: just chug, chug water and like eat some freaking. Back up in your ass with the resurrection. Boom turning it off all right that being said okay enough of that but uh yeah so gonna take you guys along my workout uh next video is actually gonna be a q a with the female marine hey everyone i'm ali what's up so definitely be on the lookout for that and then we got some more videos planned out some more pft videos that you guys have requested me to do about you know the green berets we got the russian spesnaz we got a bunch of pfts which is crazy um push my body through some pain after doing those thousand push-ups if you guys haven't checked it out go check it out yeah. the final push so my body is still really sore but uh that being said it's about that time man it's about that time so cheers ah, it's fuego time that being said today we're actually gonna be talking about a topic that you guys have been highly requesting me to talk about um and that's uh you know what are the things that you can expect from the military all right and um you know that's that's a bad mindset to have you know expecting something from the military um, you know, you shouldn't expect anything in life. What can I gain from this? What can I gain from being in the military rather than what can I expect? Um, so um, some of the things that you can gain from the military, all right, and just keep this in mind is, is you know, you, you do definitely go through a lot of, uh, you know, little things that, you know, get to you, but at the end of the day, they make you a better person. So um, I was actually having a conversation with, uh, you know, some of my buddies and I'm just like, dude, if it weren't for the military and I preach this a lot because I'm going to be honest with you guys, that is, that is why I'm here today because of the military. It has taught me, you know, how to be grateful, how to love my, you know, my, my family and cherish them, how to use my time wisely, how to multitask, how to lead people at such a young age, 21 years old. And I'm, I'm leading people that are my age, you know, um, I'm grinding every day, you know, putting in that work. Now don't go in with that mindset of expecting something. Just just gain from it, learn from it, you know, live it. It's gonna suck at times, it's gonna be hard. But t I'm telling you, towards the end, you're gonna be thankful that you did it. And I can almost guarantee that you're probably gonna, you know, you're gonna miss it when you leave. And I know I'm probably gonna miss it, but I know it's for the better that I, you know, continue my path and, and do something different. So, um, that being said, you know, it, it, it's definitely you know something that I wanted to do always, but it's not a passion of mine. I that's I don't crave being in the military forever. I want to do something more with my life. I want to open up my own gym. I want to just you know expand the the fuego business. I want to you know just do a lot of things with my life. So, um, you know the military definitely does take a lot of your time. You know because it's, it's a standard job. You know you're waking up like at five, four forty five in the morning. You know so it's definitely very hard, but. Uh, you know, makes you a better person. So that being said, guys, I just want to talk to you guys really quick. Right, so we're here at the gym right now. We're pumping some iron because, you know, that's what we do, guys. We're going fuego. And you got your boy Nick right here. He had to say, what's up? Hey, man, I appreciate the support. Hey, you guys like that? Hey, man, just come up to me. I'm freaking cool. I'm not going to be like, oh, yeah, I'm better than you. You know, get away from me. Hey, just say what's up. But, hey, I appreciate the support, brother. Hell, yeah. Check it out, guys. Welcome to Okinawa, man. It's always raining, so this is the end product of what happens out here. Thing is, I saw it coming, man. Like two, a year ago, I saw it like slowly rise up, but they never took care of it. But now, hey, they're fixing it up. So, got some post-workout gains, man. Hey, hey, hey. All right, guys. So, briefly, what we got? We got two scoops of whey protein. We got some strawberries. We got a little bit of low-fat milk. Pretty basic stuff, guys. Honestly, if I make this at my barracks, I know it will taste like dookie. But here, I'm telling you, they add something. Like I said, in every smoothie place, they add something. I'm pretty sure it's the vanilla yogurt because they do add vanilla yogurt. It probably adds that little extra kick. Um, so, but uh, yeah. Anyways, man, like I said, yo, this year, I am definitely taking my training to the next level. Like, um, my peak was back in 2015, 2016 was my peak. And I was like, you know, going every day to the gym. I didn't have YouTube that much. I was just constantly going to the gym. I was focused on my girlfriend and focused on the Marine Corps. And that was my main priority was the gym. So 
Um, then 2017 rolled around. I started getting, you know, a lot of more expectations when it came to the editing and stuff like that. And, you know, I'm not going to make excuses here, but I did slack off. I started eating like crap. I started letting the stress get to me. And that's uh, what definitely took a toll onto my, you know, uh, my physique. And you guys saw it. You guys called me out on it. And you know what? I was real with you guys. I was like, dude, I'm gaining weight or, you know, hey, man, this and this happened. So not going to lie. We all fall off. But hey, jump back on the horse. Get back on it and freaking keep doing about your day. So, that being said, guys, I'm actually reading a book that I want to talk to you guys really quick. Hopefully, the wind isn't hitting the mic too much. But, this book is called uh, The Subtle Art of Not Giving a f um, So, I know um, some of you guys are my, you know, my younger audience. Uh, I do not advise you guys reading this book. But, uh, for some of those that are around the 20, 18, or over age, I definitely recommend this audiobook. And it's literally talking about just like how in life, we care way too much on what people think. Uh, we we get mad for being mad um, We get mad for being sad or you know different things guys and we let our emotions dictate our life a lot of the time You know we think we're you know not su successful um, Because of our mindset, you know the mindset is what plays a big role You know sometimes I'm gonna be honest with you. I think to myself man I'm not there yet like I, I wish I could be somewhere like you know I want to be better and bigger than and 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 I want to improve my quality and and I just bring myself down and I realize that I bring myself down and I start to think to myself you know man I need to start providing more I need to start being better but at the end of the day I just gotta stop caring so much and just roll with the flow just just do your thing do what you love this is what you began with you know just a camera and like you're 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 Sony Vegas and you made this you know. And um, it's it's not necessarily about like the fancy editing, the craziness. It's more about being real to the audience and being real to you guys and just showing you guys, you know, transitioning from, you know, an active duty Marine to, you know, hopefully someday a successful business owner. And uh, that's what I'm trying to show you guys that no matter the circumstances, that's the purpose of the channel is, you know, being healthy, being fit, you know, uh, achieving your dreams no matter the circumstances. That, that, that's my biggest thing is, you know, whatever happens in life, you can still be successful. All right, don't let other people dictate who you are as a person. So that being said, this book talks a lot about this stuff, man. And I was just listening to it while I was doing my cardio. And it's crazy, dude. You, you just sometimes you got to draw the line, guys. Draw the freaking line and just stop caring what people think, okay? Because in this book, it even says in this book, he, he says, you're going to die one day. You're going to die one day. Newsflash. There it is. Ha ha. So um, why, why do you care so much, you know? Uh, so that being said, you know, keep pushing forward, guys. Keep living your life. Keep doing you, man. Just keep doing you. Who cares what people think and what people say about you? You just keep pushing forward. People want to give you ugly looks, want to look at you like, whoa, what the hell? You just got rejected by that hot girl or you got rejected by that guy. Hey, man, who cares, man? Just another day, man. Keep pushing forward. Make those gains. Go fuego time. Link in the description, guys. Check everything out. If you guys want to get that free Navy workout program, Air Force program is available as well. I love you guys. Thank you guys for much for everything. Thank you guys so much for everything. The wind's about to hit really hard. The wind's about to freaking destroy this mic. But anyways, guys, remember, stay hungry, stay humble, turn life you keep doing you and go about your day. Don't listen to the people on the sidelines because you got one life, your life. Make shit happen or send the silence and by life. Stop caring what people think. Live your life. Make those gains. Hey, and have a great day, okay? Be sure to smash the thumbs up. Be sure to comment down. Hashtag for you at this point. Hey, you guys are the true MVPs, okay? I love you guys. All right, hey, stay smiling. All right, 2018, those goals. Make it happen, all right?